All right, guys. So today I want to walk you through a few things that you can check if your LG TV is having issues connecting or staying connected to your Wi-Fi. I'll do my best to help you get your Wi-Fi issues situated. And if it does help, if you could like the video, consider subscribing to the channel. Now with Wi-Fi and anything tech, there could be so many different issues to why we're having these uh, Wi-Fi connection issues. And I'll give you some of the main reasons. I did a, a video for this on the uh, Samsung TV, and a lot of people were saying that a simple soft reset was able to help them um, get their Wi-Fi back in order. And a soft reset is really, don't judge me, it's just unplugging the TV here. And then once it's unplugged, just leave it unplugged for like a minute, longer if possible. We're gonna let all that electricity build up that's in the TV kind of dissipate, and then it will help the uh, TV runs smoother. Seriously, so many times it was that simple to solve your Wi-Fi issues. Now, if something like that doesn't help, we're going to check the Wi-Fi. A lot of times you might be having a weak Wi-Fi. For example, my Wi-Fi router is way down that hallway. And sometimes it is a little bit weak. So what I did was I got a Google router, Google Nest Wi-Fi, and I put it halfway through the hallway so that uh, the Wi-Fi is much stronger out here. Now to test this, we can run a B test on the TV. And to do that, you would just uh, go to the web browser on your TV, go to speedtest.net, I believe, and you can uh, run a speed test there. If that's too much, you can actually just take your phone, put it next to the TV, and then do the same thing. Run a speed test to see if your Wi-Fi is weak. Now, another issue might be congestion. Now, every once in a while, a device of mine gets kicked offline because I have so many smart devices connected to my Wi-Fi. Now, to check if there's congestion, you're just going to open up your router app. Mine is the uh, Google Home app. And there you can see all of the different uh, devices that are, that are connected to your TV. If you can, kick some of those devices off. They're only still in bandwidth and uh, see if that helps. Now, another issue could be, and, and, and don't come for me, that your Wi-Fi password was input wrong. So to check that, we would just go to the network section over here and go to the Wi-Fi connection. So we will check the Wi-Fi connection here. And again, we just wanna see that check mark. We wanna see all these bars and make sure that we have a really good connection with our Wi-Fi. Another issue might be that our software is outdated. So uh, what we can do here to check for an update, mine is in this uh, support section, and then there's a software update section here. And you can just select this. I'm actually gonna turn on allow automatic updates, and I'll check for updates. And it said no updates found, but if you have an update, you're obviously gonna wanna run that because it could be causing your issue with the Wi-Fi. Now, other issues, we're gonna to wanna to make sure that the actual router itself is in good order. If there's dust around it, clean it off. Um, you can also soft reset that thing. Un unplug it for minimum of 60 seconds uh, to see if that helps with your connectivity issues. And a lot of times there'll be an option to uh, restart the network inside of the app. Again, I use the Google Home app so I can restart the network through the app to see if that helps. Now, last worst case scenario, we would run a factory reset. And the factory reset is again in that support section, very bottom option, reset to initial settings. I'm not even gonna touch that because I don't wanna lose my settings, but this is just another thing that we can check. So uh, a lot of options here. Now, if you're able to, the best option is always just a plug your router into your TV. If you can do that, you should, because then you don't have to fight with Wi-Fi. So that's the video for today, guys. I hope it helps. If it does, let me know in the comments, and I'll see you next time.